Hey, get back here. So, I logged on to Madden today, and look what I ran across. Michael Vick arriving 10-9. On one hand, it's great for the Steelers theme team. And you know when things are great for the Steelers theme team, it's great for America. On the other hand, RPO glitching is outrageous right now with the double pumps. And, and escape artist quarterbacks have never been more powerful than they have been right now. At least in like the last, you know, half decade to like it's 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 insane right escape artist right now and, and michael vick what are they gonna give him like 93 speed maybe you'll get him up to i guess without sprinter it's a little bit better since it's only wide receivers getting it this year but i like i have enough trouble stopping like 86 speed quarterbacks adding another five or more on top of that with vick arriving 10 9 in the legends program <sighs> Cue the sad songs that actually... Don't cue them, don't cue them, don't cue them. Stop, stop. We don't want to get, uh, you know, copyrighted here on YouTube. So we're just going to go on and live our time. 10-9 for Michael Vick. All right, so... <laughs> I'm so disappointed that they brought him into the game before they patched their RPOs. And Escape Artist is wild right now, right? You put you could you put contains on your field and you get no pass rush. You have no contain in your field and you have no contains, right? It's it's you damn if you do, damn if you don't. And it's it's just gonna even become worse. Alright, so we are getting house rules tomorrow though. It's a little echoey right now. Let me let me close this door. Whoop, those that's my list. That's my list. We got redux. I don't know if you guys read that quick enough. I guess I can intro the whole thing. Uh that's my list for the intro. We got house rules, holiday season starting next week, reduxes, limited solo battles, weekend leagues updates, that kind of stuff coming today on a Fox near you. Give me a second. We're back. We're back. Woo! Okay, so house rules rewards. Here they are. Um, 5,000 coins, 82 gridiron guardian player, 10,000 coins, 35 wins. But it was 25 wins as like the, the top one. Wait, did they skim past that a little bit? All right, well, here are the rules, All right? Here are the rules. We'll go to the rewards in a second. Basically, they've screwed over rewards in house rules. It's it's at um, 25 wins right here. Oh, I, I missed it again. Damn, this streamer sucks. All right, well, let's let it play out. But anyways, it's an 86 overall or 90 overall NCAT GG hero. I, like, I don't understand why they can't make a custom card for this. Would it be that hard to make a custom card one- for house rules, you're already doing the hard part, okay? The hard part is designing the house rules, implementing and putting it in a game, okay? And then you, you, the reward structure is just like terrible as it is right now. And it, it, it's, it's, you know, disheartening to see that they're so disconnected from the player base. We grind this game mode of Madden Ultimate Team to improve our ultimate team. When you give us things to grind, we love it, but you gotta reward us for the grind too. You gotta give us the second half of the promise, okay? So it is a 90 overall NCAT. I no clue why it's an NCAT. 80, if it was an NCAT, this should be 92 overall. 25 wins? Come on, man. Come on. Like, like we are people, okay? This takes our time. And I get it. We should be playing for the love of the game. But you know what? Other player. Tom Brady plays for the love of the game, but he also gets paid, okay? He took a little bit less of a pay to make New England great all those years, but he still gets paid, okay? Please, we play for the love of the game, but we also we want to get paid a little bit. We want to get paid off with our rewards. So please, EA, implement better rewards than this going forward. It's it's sad. I hate it. Not why if they ruin their own good things. It's not like you're gonna make less money if that was like a 92 end cat. Okay, you could have given us one of the big ones. It could have been a, seri a series Redux players that are introducing, right? So the series Redux players is the transition into it. We got Devin White on the way. It's basically all the 91s are getting Redux. So, so if you thought Waller fell yesterday a lot with Jared Cook card, wait till tomorrow. The thing is, like, these cards aren't going to be pulled very often. They're only out of packs. You guys are seeing them all. Leonard Davis, whatever, whatever. Um, so basically what's going to happen is people are going to sell off. We've seen this in the past. And maybe I, I could be wrong, right? This is a new year, new us. Pack odds could easily increase, which would screw this whole statement up. But basically, these things get introduced. And then people freak out and sell theirs. So you're going to see a huge market crash today on these cards, uh, on these limiteds. 
and then it's going to kind of slowly rise up exact same thing happened in previous series changeovers even when the pack odds increased um so probably best not to panic sell like a lot of people are but if the pack odds do go up a tremendous amount, oh wow sorry for bourbon a tremendous amount if the pack odds go up then the 91s will be um basically coming out of packs a lot more and the price will be low lower but there it is the series redux all the 91s coming out tomorrow i don't like oh uh, we don't know right this was kind of sprung upon us i talked about series reduxes uh market mondays and stuff like that but like last year with the series is they give us like a week heads up um they don't say they say they don't have series now they got seasons or whatever it is uh, but I, I no, I, I wish they'd give us a little bit more communications and heads up ahead of time on a lot of these things instead of like day before, boom, they're in packs. But EA, I don't know, they they like to be, they like to move in silence, I guess. Uh, weekend League rewards, uh, Madden Mobile, don't care. They killed Madden Mobile. It's hilarious how bad they've, they've turned that game, right? Please don't ever hire any Madden Mobile staff. You've already made a mistake hiring an NBA Live staff um, for this game. I did, oh no, I kind of wanted to go through... Yeah, Twitch got Twitch is messed up. So change your passwords on Twitch, everybody. Re we gotta reauthenticate your stuff there. Um, let's talk about the limiteds in game right now. Um, Holly, also, Kralos said one thing that was very interesting. Well, he said it at, right at the end. I hate when he says things at the end after the giveaways because I always t tend to tune out at the giveaways because that's just a waste of my time. But he did say there's a holiday season starting next week, and he was very like, uh, um, what's the word for it? excited tempting i don't know what you got he was very mysterious about it we'll say about holiday season and exciting things starting rodney hudson a million coins way overpriced uh but he is a raiders theme team center so we'll end up getting him for the theme team because raiders theme team is overpowered as heck uh but with that we expect that to be like a halloween promo right the thing is, like, so if it's next Friday, right? So we're getting uh, Reduxes tomorrow, the 8th. Next Friday, the 15th, could be the start of Most Feared, which would actually put it on a pretty decent track uh, for a two-week promo uh, for multiple se multiple drops during those two weeks. And, uh, I, yeah, I don't mind it. I, I, I'm i excited, right? Last year, we got Palomalu. Um, hopefully, they bring in another new legend, uh, since that was huge last year, since they brought in somebody that was, uh, you know, that hadn't been in Mutt since he retired rodney hudson himself just looks like a very solid offense lineman a better pass blocker than run blocker 315 so he, he likes uh, we like him thick he looks very thick on his picture he takes up like the whole frame plus they don't get much more thicker than that uh but uh, there you go for rodney hudson for one of the limiteds the other one was a uh, safety mr may for the jets for the Benny and the Jet. There he is. May. Two million coins. All right. So these things aren't really getting pulled. I really hope they increase the limited pull rates in these uh, in these packs. It's been brutal lately. Um, yeah. So this card itself. Pretty good zone co zone safety. I actually don't mind it at all. Um, gets up to 93 speed, 94 speed with the power up uh, if you're with your DB strat cards and everything. Uh, so a pretty solid safety. One that I'll try and get. No promises, though. Uh, but... Uh, there's for the limited. Let's pull some packs for him and, and, and talk a little bit about what what uh, most feared could be. And I think I'll do. I'll, I'll, I'll focus my market Monday around most feared content. So that will be kind of like the uh, uh, intro to it uh, on Monday. I guess I could do like other videos if that. Like I don't know. I was. I, I never know what I want to do. Um, if I want to do videos focused, maybe I'll do a video specifically focusing around Halloween promo instead of just you know pegging it into market Monday. Game changer pack. Or clutch pack. What are the highest overall odds? 88, 4% chance for the clutch for 600 points. This is 9% for 87. So we're definitely going to go clutch. Clutch is cheaper and uh, as the higher overall, but I don't, I, they really show overall in the other one. We do pro fan packs. 10% chance and 85 plus, and it's only 250 points. Let's mix between this one and the clutch pack. So, solo battles, uh, Kralo talked about them being messed up. And we saw them, like, PS4. They had, like, the LSU team on them, which was 90 overall. And they were, like, insanely... Because, like, Slider's are already jacked in solo battles. We know that to be a fact. They they jack them up. Um, like, we in the den get jacked up on Mountain Dew. But, you thought I was going to say off. 
It was weird to me that he said he had to ping some old people in new roles, right? Like, don't they have somebody currently in the solo battle role? Like, why would you have to go to people that used to do it? Does, like, is it just like on an auto updater? What's going on there? That made no sense to me. Like, you'd think there would be somebody there that currently does that instead of the people that moved down to new roles for the solo battles. Maybe, it, maybe it's, I, I, you know, I've worked at the bureaucracy before. A new project's implemented, especially one that's automated, like solo battles. Maybe it was automated and nobody picked up the work. Whoops, I forgot. This is in a selection pack. It's just a bad pack. And so it just keeps updating every week. And so like, like, hey, how does this code work? What's going on here? How do solo battle solo battle? And how do we fix this now? <laughs> like they got people working on the... Uh, rewards and everything but they don't know how it's updated what i don't know maybe i'm thinking too much into that uh weekend link issues also so like uh, september's based off the four weeks of september october's based off of uh four weeks but you get five weeks to accomplish it in so october if you're gonna play weekend league october is the month to play weekend league in you definitely want to head into weekend league for october uh, because it's going to be a lot easier to get the monthlies. Because you get five sh five weeks of shots at it. I forgot. I'm not doing a fantasy pack. I keep doing that. Uh, definitely get into October weekend league. Especially if you play this first week. If not, then you still got four weeks left to go. Let's do a fantasy pack since I seem to want to do it so much. So that's nice for the weekend league grinders. I myself, I play a little bit of it. I, I If I played more of it, I don't know. I... I Madden is in a very strange place right now. I the my least favorite thing, and I didn't check these out, but people in chat told me there are missions now that EA has this going on for run yards in head to head, and we should go. I should go look at that. I I really should have looked at it before this video because I knew I was going to talk about it. But people have discovered how good RPO stretches are. We already know about the RPO pump fake bubble cheese, right? We already knew about that. But RPO stretches, dives, those those single back formations with like 50 tight ends on the line of scrimmage. And I hate it. I hate it. The run game, and there are certain runs that are so overpowered and stupidly good they, that, that people are starting to discover them. And the, the, the online meta is just getting worse and worse. It, I, I, you, wouldn't have, you wouldn't have thought this weeks ago, a month ago, but... The gun bunch meta to make people make reads on you. Yeah, sure, it's very easy to make reads. The best players are still in gun bunch because it's still the most powerful formation. But it's still more fun to play against than freaking stretch and dive. Stretch and dive and playing against those two plays. Shades of Madden 20, the worst Madden meta that we've seen in a long time. And uh, luckily we don't have a Dickerson, but uh, they start dropping these overpowered running backs like they're dropping this overpowered quarterback on Saturday. It could be a, a rough landing for this game. And I really hope they do end up uh, at least trying a little bit to still fix middle linebackers' reactions and, and run uh, defense. Because right now, it's it's brutal. It, it is it is really bad how poorly defensive play rec is against the run. Wait, I got probably have like a high silver, don't I? Nah, I'll just take him. Anyways... It looks like we're not getting very lucky on our limited. It's pulling a couple of uh, Vitas, though. It's pulling some uh, Vitamixes. We'll do We'll do another one. What else do I want to talk about? The Limiteds. Another Raiders theme team another day, right? Because Hudson is a Raiders theme team player. And you know what? Is it time to stop worrying and love the bomb, right? EA's shown they have a terrible time balancing things, right? They're some of the worst balanced games in existence, are EA games. And Madden especially. And so is it funny to see the Mutt staff go the same direction the Madden, like, gameplay staff has gone? Where it's like, ah, we don't care that much about uh, balance, 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 right? Play the game. Adjust. Adjust, guys. And they're like, yeah, let's just keep throwing out Raiders without any freaking concern for other theme teams. It's so weird. It is so weird that they keep getting new ones. I said yesterday, if Raiders don't get another card for like two months, it'll be about equal, right? It'll be about equal on the Raiders theme team. And I really hope they don't. 
I really hope the Raiders take an L for the next few months. Oh, this video's gone on a lot longer than I thought it would. All right, let's, this is the last pack. We got to shut it down. So, yeah, I guess we'll see. Raiders Ultimate Team marches on. Um, Is Adams going for a lot because that one card he got? I don't know. We'll see. He might go up a little bit because that free 90 from House Rules. Uh, but uh, overall, yeah, all golds in the last round. Way to, way, to, way to end it for us. That's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I'm excited for next week, especially if we get most spirit on Friday. Should be a good time. Otherwise, thanks for watching. Call to action. I will see you tomorrow.